Yo, what's going on, guys? Today, we're gonna be playing 2.3 log bait cycle on top ladder. Oh, wait. No. Guys, I forgot to put goblin barrel. We have log instead of goblin barrel. No. Okay, you know what? I don't think we have any chance. Man, it's over. We almost had him, though. How dare I let an expo player win? We're up against one of the best named players I ever met. I'll Goblin Barrel Fire Spirit. You have to be so aggressive with this deck. You have a really quick cycle, so it's easy to get damage early, but it does get quite a bit harder later. Okay, just have to pressure. We have no big spell. I'm pretty sure this guy has E Golem. It is kind of nice to have the Valkyrie for the Skelly King at least. Hopefully Barrel can do some damage to the pump. Okay, he will have the double small spell version, so this will be quite hard. We have really good defense, I feel like, but we just can't kill the pumps, unfortunately. And he has such a quick cycle, too. Even though we have a quick cycle, he also does, so I don't know if we can outcycle him too easily. Yeah, there's the purple blob. Just gonna princess first, try to maybe bait out the arrows with it and then get to his second one. I don't know if he's actually gonna make a big push here or not since he's still pumping up. Just gonna cannon. I don't really care about the pump too much for now. Just have to make sure we don't lose our tower right here. I feel like we can still defend even if we're down a bit of elixir, but we're gonna probably get chipped out little by little or just die to a huge push. Well, at least we're alive for now, but we're still down so much elixir. I'm gonna wall breakers to force out something and then hopefully Barrel can take out a bit of the pump. Oh man, that was pretty bad. That only got like one stab on the pump. I'll Valkyrie here just to force out something on our princess. We do have our Evo Skeletons. I feel like if one thing can save us right now, it's going to be the Evo Skeletons. If we can get really good defensive value out of it. Beautiful Fire Spirit. Let's go. Okay, these bats will be a bit of an issue now though. Oh no. I don't know if Ice Spirit will do the job or not. Okay, that was a pretty nice Ice Spirit. <laughs> he just missed the princess. <laughs> okay, this is what we needed. Um, Wallbreakers on defense. Bit of a missed rage. Okay, we're somehow alive. We are down in damage, but we're still alive, and his pumps are pretty much gone now. <laughs> I don't know how he just defended that. Okay, that might be tower. Yeah, okay. We probably have, like, one more push to defend. We already have double princess down, though, so I'm not too worried about it. We have good damage on the left side already as well. <laughs> Three princesses, man. Okay, we should be fine here. If he somehow breaks through, he deserves an E Golem award. <laughs> I don't think he's going to, though. Yeah, no chance. Valkyrie is so clutch in this matchup. If we had a knight, I feel like we definitely would have lost already. Alright. I'll see you guys in the next match. I think I faced this guy not that long ago. If I remember correctly, he was playing the Flying Beast. We only have Princess for air defense, so... I don't know if we have any chance to win this type of matchup. I mean, I guess we have a chance because we have such an aggressive deck, so even though we can't defend, we can still maybe try to... just pressure so much that he can't make a good push. But I don't know, he's gonna have to play pretty bad for us to have a chance. Yeah, it is Lava Hound. Gonna bear with this too, try to... force him to over-defend or just tower trade. Okay, nice to not have to deal with the Skeleton Dragons now on the left side. Pretty good damage with the Valkyrie too. If we get really good Evo Skeletons later, that could also allow us to win this match. We could try to pull this Inferno Dragon to the middle, but I don't know if we actually can. Yeah, we can't, honestly. Just have to pull this back. We need another Princess quickly. Okay, I think we should be okay. We can also fire Tiny. <laughs> that was pretty beautiful. We can just pressure. What does he have for the Evo Wallbreakers? Does he have anything? Nothing. Okay, well, I mean, that's a pretty good start. I'm still not feeling too good, though. I feel like we can't defend if he makes a single good push. If he makes a single good Lava Loon push, we can't defend. I'm nearly certain he's going to have the balloon too. Man, it kind of sucks that Evo Bomber fully counters Goblin Barrel. 
But there's one good thing about this. We can now get the King Tower activation for free. Man, he's up so much elixir too. See, I don't know if we can actually defend this Lava Hound right now. But maybe our King Tower will help out. We have to Fire Spirit here to take Tower because we have no small spell in this deck. Our only spell is Goblin Barrel. You don't really need a small spell when you have such a quick deck like this. Okay, we have to try to cycle to a second cannon here. I feel like we can because we have such a quick cycle. It's even quicker than 2.6. Okay. Gonna Princess again. Oh no, we have to Ice Spirit. Oh, that still got a hit. No. Oh, I think that might have just lost us the game. We're already in Arrow's range. Okay, so what we have to do here is just be really aggressive and try to just get damage since he can't waste the arrows on defense. He has to use it on offense. Only one wall breaker on tower, but still some pretty solid damage. Don't really know what this Lava Hound is going to do for him. I'm still going to defend here just to force him to play the arrows on our tower. Going to Evo wall breakers. Wait, can he defend our Evo wall breakers? Wait, why would you arrows the princess? What are you doing? Bro? Let's go. We're up against a basketball hoop. I'll go in for the barrel wall breakers first play. Super aggressive, but with this deck you can normally get away with it. Wait, these might connect. Okay, I'll take it. <laughs> yeah, it really pays off to be really aggressive with this deck. If you guys try to play it passively like a normal bait deck, you're not going to have much success with it. <laughs> I feel so bad for spamming bridge princess and barrel first play every time with this deck. This guy definitely has Mega Knight. He's probably going to have Bar Barrel too, so it's not going to be too easy to break through, but we're already in a pretty good spot. He could also have Arrows, though. Going to just Barrel, see what other small spell he has. Maybe he doesn't have any small spell except Zap. This could be pretty good, then. This bait deck does actually counter quite a few meta decks, I feel like. Even against the quick cycle minor poison decks and that kind of stuff, you can still have a chance of winning. Nice wall breakers. I don't want to only stick to going in one lane. You do want to push in both lanes sometimes with this deck. We'll see if he tries to little prince ability. Don't think he will. Okay, there it is. We can just evo skellies. Wait. Evo wall breakers and he has nothing. <laughs> he can't defend. He can't defend. <laughs> the Evo Skeletons just got us such a good trade. <laughs> That's so broken. I think it's over for this guy. <laughs> There's no chance. We can cannon. Gonna also pull at least one of the bats. Okay. I'll see you guys in the next match. We're up against this guy. We have to go in for the barrel first so the cannoneer doesn't fully counter our wall breakers. Oh, he missed! <laughs> I love going for the wall breaker's barrel first play. Either my opponent doesn't have a small spell and I take half their tower, or they just don't expect it and somehow make a mistake. I think this will be giant graveyard, but it could still be a sparky deck of some kind. Princess is doing so much damage. <laughs> I feel so annoying when I play this deck. I feel like an annoying kid, like Riley. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Ooh, is Little Prince in front or behind? Oh, that's in front! Let's go! We have no small spell for the graveyard, so we always have to play our Valkyrie on it. Otherwise, we just can't defend. That was a really bad ability. We can barrel now and force out whatever he has. Okay, a couple stabs on the tower. Cannoneer isn't going to be too good for him in this matchup. It's good against our wall breakers, but Eva wall breakers still can wreck it. And also, the barrel is quite good against Cannoneer. We'll see what he does here for the princess. Okay, he has the Dark Prince version. I don't even want to waste the Valkyrie, to be honest. No reason to. We can pull this back, but the Wallbreakers won't even connect anyways. Oh, I guess they're dead. <laughs> oh, he wasted the bats, though. Okay. We do have our Evo Skeletons now, so we can be even more aggressive. <laughs> okay, he actually predicted it. A lot of the time, though, unless your opponents know you well, they just don't predict you very well when you have this deck because they don't expect you to be so crazy aggressive for no reason. Free Evo Skelly's here. He's going to have to respond to them too since he has Cannoneer. They're just so good against it. Okay, wait. This could be good. This could be very good. <laughs> That's so much damage. That's so much damage. Wow. <laughs> 
We still need to take his tower, though. We have no way to connect without our goblin barrel. So, we'll see. Wait, wait, guys. Free king tower activation, right? Hopefully it goes on the cannon and not the Valkyrie. Okay. <laughs> I think we just won. Well, we do still have to get damage somehow, but... I don't see him getting too much damage anymore. The Evo Skellies and Evo Wallbreakers really carry here. Okay, couple Goblin Stabs. We can still always outcycle him. He can't really use a Snowball to counter our Goblin Barrels since he has the Cannoneer instead of Princess Tower. Okay, he's going to probably Graveyard. We have to Valkyrie low. I think the main takeaway in this matchup is just to always go for the Valkyrie on the Graveyard instead of their supporting troops. Wait guys, we still need damage though, but look at the left side. Okay. Just gonna barrel, we have to just try to outcycle. Man, that evil bummer might get on our tower. No, no, no. Oh, we won! Let's go! We're up against one of the fiercest forces I ever met. I know who this guy is, he's a Sparky player, but... We're in pretty big trouble since we have no rocket. I always love facing Sparky when I have log bait, but... In this case, I don't know. We do have a chance, I feel like, since we have such an aggressive deck, but hopefully he doesn't catch on that we have no rocket. Oh, pretty bad goblin giant. Don't know what that was for. Oh, the princess is on the goblin giant. Okay, so he will have barbaro and arrows. This will not be so good. If he had just one small spell to counter our barrel, that would be okay, but this might be pretty bad. We'll see, though. Anything could happen. Okay, that will connect. <laughs> I don't know what this guy's doing right now. This guy always spams that wizard emote, but then he always ends up making misplays because he's so busy spamming. <laughs> okay, just one goblin stab on the tower. I guess it's okay. We do have our Evo Wallbreakers up next. What does he actually have for Evo Wallbreakers right now? Does he have anything? That's not going to do a very good job. <laughs> okay. I mean, that's some really good damage. I'll just go for the Valkyrie. Kind of want to save our Evo Skellies. Uh, we can just barrel. And then he's going to waste his spell on it. So then we can Evo Skellies. And now he can't kill our Evo Skellies. That's perfect. <laughs> Want Elixir for 6 on the Shrek. <laughs> Got a Princess with this and Wallbreakers. Oh, that was so bad. Oh, I was hoping he would play something low for the Evo Skelly so that he wouldn't be able to react quickly enough to get everything. He has nothing for the barrel, though. Well, no small spell. I mean, I'll still take it. Overall, a pretty good sequence for us here. We're kind of just abusing this guy right now. <laughs> just bullying him, I guess you could say. I think this guy does have Lightning 2 in his deck, so I'll just go for the Cannon early so we can get a second one if we really need it. Gonna barrel kind of far back, maybe hope he misses his spell or something. Okay, well, I'll take that. Gonna Valk on these things, Ice Tiny to reset. Gonna Cannon again. And Evo Skellies. I think we're all good here. <laughs> this guy has no chance, even with double small spell against the Log Bait deck. Alright, thank you guys for watching, and see you in the next one. Bye!